Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Matt, aka Doggeth with Aim the Game, and today I want to show you guys how to uh, use our mad mod pack installer to install a mod pack. So I'm going to log into my game control panel, go ahead and hit stop. In my file manager, I'm either going to take a backup, which you can see here I have, or I am going to go ahead and uh, just wipe my files out. I'm going to go ahead and, you know what, I took my backup already. We have a video up of that if you guys have any. Uh, need to do that go ahead and look that up uh, but for now I'm gonna delete it make sure you download your backup so that uh, let's say we want to restore our old world uh, later after we're done playing with this mod pack we'll, we'll have that available so it's gone what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to my mod manager here so once you're at your mod manager let's just say for you know example let's go ahead and install uh, feed the beast ultimate 112 Sometimes Archon Password is going to be empty. Just type whatever you want in there, click install. And what it's going to do is it's going to go out to our central repository where we keep all of these mod configurations and stuff like that. It's going to pull it down, uh, download it, and then it extracts it inside of your file manager for you. As you can see right here, your previously empty uh, file manager is now full. Now there's a couple things we have to take care of. Let's go ahead and start here. And what it should do is if you open up your file manager. So once we're in our file manager, you'll see that it's creating some files here. Once the server.log is created, you can click on your web console and you can actually see what is going on. Now, sometimes you guys will get this fail to bind to port. This is a wicked easy fix. Go ahead and let's refresh our file manager. Go into your server properties, and most of the time when you do uh, a mod pack install, you're going to have to do this. Uh, find the line that says server IP and type in your IP address. Uh, don't type what I'm typing. Type your own. And then uh, server port, if you have 25575 or 85, use that uh, there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit save on that. I'm going to just click on my IP up here, and I'm going to restart. <clears throat> if we go back to our console, it's going to be restarting our server taking its sweet time and as you can see it's gonna start back up and then it will shoot through all of the configuration and stuff downloading files and all that initial stuff that a mod pack does when it first starts up and generates the world and everything like that so that's pretty much how you guys install a mod pack uh, it's pretty quick and easy there's not too much pain I mean you have to set your IP address generally or if you have a non-standard port you have to change that but it's quick easy painless and with this video hopefully it helped if you guys have any questions comments concerns throw them down below as always we're at support at aim to aim .com, and we are at aim to game .com. top right corner click billing and support and send us a ticket 24 hours a day we're here for you guys so until the next time my name is Doggeth or Matt and then uh, you guys need to enjoy yourselves Thank you.